I feel super nice this morning. I had my medicines last night, so I'm feeling much better. There's no fever. I don't have a body pain anymore, and my throat is getting better, better as well. So yeah, I'm ready to go. And in addition to all of these things, it stopped raining. It was literally raining the entire day yesterday, and we did not go out. We made sure that Nikhil rested well, so that this day we could. Explore more. We could just have fun, and uh, for breakfast, that's why we are having a healthy yogurt glass. It has a lot of dry fruits, but the thing that I'm most excited about is these dried up strawberries. Um, it looks nice, and this is how we are gonna start our day today, a healthy start. And we've also, like right now, we are not 100% sure, but we have also thought to take cycles to uh, go around the city today. I don't know how to actually ride a bicycle but I hope that it goes well for us. <laughs> So after a two hour session on how to cycle 101 for Trisha, <laughs> she did really well, but she's still a little scared. So we are now walking. I got too tired as well because I was running behind her to help her. Yeah. So that got a little too tiring for me also. So after we went to the room, we freshened up and now we're heading to, where are we going? To get our clothes. Oh yeah, so now we are going to get our clothes. Uh, yeah, we were supposed to go and pick them up yesterday, but it was raining the entire day and I was not well. So today, we were going to do that. It's really nice today, the weather. Yeah, the weather is super nice. At least for walking. Yeah, it's windy also. Yeah, but, uh, but I see clouds. So I'm a little scared that it might rain again. Yesterday it kept raining the entire day. Looks very pretty. We finally reached the place that we got our clothes from. The person here is super sweet and she was very precise with uh, what I wanted and you know uh, and how can she deliver the same. So yeah, so we have reached outside the shop. Let me show you around. So they make both women and men's clothing uh, with many dresses on display and honestly uh, there's so much work on display that it kind of gives you a gist of the place then there are a few more dresses and so many fabrics and prints to choose from which is one thing that I really like the good part is that they get it all made for you in 24 hours which is something that it is very very famous for we are waiting for the person to come she's gone somewhere nearby so we said that you know we, we might have to wait for five minutes we'll do that and till then we just chilling chilling here look who's here the is good how do i do I think it's a little bit long. Is it? Do you like the length? Yeah. yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Yeah. Right about that. Now I'm going to try my dress. Let's see. Hello. Hello. It was ready. <laughs> after we have tried all our clothes we are extremely happy a couple of tips that i would like to give anybody who is watching and willing to do this is um have enough days in hoi an so that you're able to get this done because sometimes the weather conditions uh, are unpredictable and sometimes you might want to get things altered a little bit or uh, you know if you're not satisfied or anything 
so yeah but overall it was a great experience for me my dress actually got ready in 24 hours thanks to win and i just love it it looks so flattering on me i personally find it really really nice and would like to thank win for it thank you so much for wonderful dress <laughs> Thank, Thank you, you so welcome, much. Please. No problem. I'm happy to survive you are. Thank you so much. You really helped in patterns and everything. I'm yeah. really happy. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah. She's wonderful. If you're here, come say hi. And that was how we got tailor-made clothing from Hoi An. And it was the first time that we've gotten something like this done outside of India. So we were super happy about it. We are here at Ban Mi Phuong. It is such a beautiful little place, and I'm pretty surprised that we got a place to sit here because usually there are like long lines outside of it, and that's what I actually heard. So I thought that this is gonna be way crowded, and maybe we'll have to we, we won't be able to have food here. But fortunately, we got a seat, and our food is also almost here. So if you see the tables of this place, people have like left some memories, their passport size photos, their tickets etc. So I asked Nikhil to make some something like that. Abanis are here. And that That goes for you too. If you were also here and if you found this and that's how you came to our channel then definitely let us know in the comment section. <laughs> Though I'm really not sure if that's gonna happen but if that happens then say hi! I ordered a sausage bun me. Nicholas got in a chicken and cheese bun. This is so good. I love it. So yesterday, while walking towards our hotel, we saw this very beautiful bridge it was like full of lights and we saw something happening on the other side there was like a lot of music from that place towards this so we thought what is this like what is happening there and that's when we saw the Hoi An memories land and we are very eager to explore what is it and what is the hype about because people seem to be like shouting with excitement so we would want to see what is on the other side of bridge. Let's see. The view from here. Oh my goodness. Right across the bridge, we found an entire theme park. And at the end of the theme park, there's going to be a theater show. It's going to be a, a yeah, program. Yeah. It's, it's an entire program. I don't know the scale of it, I don't know what it is, but we just bumped into it and we got a ticket. Why not? Let's go. <laughs> Thank you.
And now we are entering the ninja school. Ooh. Oh, this is a maze. Can you get him? Do you think we can get out? Right from here, yes. <laughs> Shouldn't be that hard though. I'm sure it's for kids. Is that the exit? That's it? That's dead end. I'm okay. You were checking the dead end? Yes. <laughs> this is exciting. Well, we've reached okay. here. <laughs> I thought that this is the end of it, but it's not. We're in the middle of the place, right? Yeah. Yes, right? You wanna go? But I'm scared you said it's flimsy. Oh, yeah. Just watch a step. Watch a step. We came upstairs, and that is where we came from. That there. Is the exit. I can see it. And you can also see the beautiful trees. Looks so real. It's not though. Are you sure? Yeah. I think I did my 10,000 steps in this maze today. <laughs> not Dead end. I told you it's there. No, no, no. That's not the one. See? That ends in the forest. <laughs> this is the one I saw. No. <laughs> and I navigated us to this way that we are now both free and safe. Loira, I can see. How do you feel to be free and safe? <laughs> We're in the ninja school training ground. And this hand here looks like snow. <laughs> I cannot bend like that. I'm pretty sure they're smiling under the basket as well. It says no video recording in there, so I don't think it's, we will be recording in there. We've gotten in our seats and uh, people are uh, still, settling still settling in. I think we've got one of the best seats that we could. We are literally second from the last of our class. We, put, we took eco class seats and we are right in the middle of it. So I'm really happy about our seats. 
and we can't see the set right now but I can tell that there are particular elements that are going to be Amazing. very exciting. Yeah. yeah. So, one of the most amazing shows I've ever seen. That was really nice. It had like extremely high production value. It was really nice. Amazing. I totally enjoyed it throughout. In fact, we couldn't even understand how the time just went by. We are enjoying it way too much. It was so much fun. People are waiting here in queues to get linked with them. But I'll just show you these other people, some of the people from the show and they did an amazing job. They were so well coordinated, everything was like so on the spot and loved it, totally loved it. Trisha saw this walking style in the show and then decided that's how she's going to be walking home. How do I look? Let's not discuss that part. <laughs> it made sense when 50 of them were doing with dresses that were lighting up. Imagine, <laughs> we couldn't record the show for you but imagine, this is what was the transition step.